I think when you get to be over the age of 65 um, and you've seen a lot of different physicians, a lot of times they're really good about adding different medications on. And no one really takes that role of, you know, getting rid of medications when they're no longer appropriate. The older population is different than the younger population, so maybe medications that they were once on that were appropriate for the younger population um, might not be appropriate for them anymore. So just simply you know, going through the list every time, making sure that all of these medications are exactly where we want them to be, whether or not we actually need them or not. So we see them as kind of a primary care physician. When they first come see us, we do a whole set of screenings on debility and frailty and nutrition and cognitive screening, dementia. Um, so really taking a big look at the whole picture and seeing kind of how those things play against each other and maybe what things would be appropriate and not appropriate anymore. What I would say was most important as far as a patient coming to see us or anyone in the division of geriatrics is that we are specialists um, in people over the age of 65 and so the things that, we, that they were doing and the medicines that they were taking um, when they were younger just might not be appropriate anymore and so it's always good to come and get a counsel and see kind of how they're doing. Mm -hmm.